Hey, this is Brett, and this 2013 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500 is stock number 13158Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used sports car headquarters. This 2013 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500 has the 5.8 liter supercharged V8 engine puts out 662 horsepower. This car has been fully safetyed and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. And this car is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, start it up and take a look under the hood. Sterling gray metallic is the color. And I shoot all my videos in 4K, so if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, smartphone, or television, I highly recommend turning them on right now because it is your best way to check out the quality, condition, options, and cleanliness of the vehicle before seeing it in person. And if you like the video and how I do things here at Summit Automotive, that's great because I do these videos each and every day. And you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and then click the bell notifications and you'll get updates every time I do the videos of our new and used inventory here at Summit Automotive. This one has the SBT Performance Package, which gives you the special uh, rims on here. You can always tell it's got the kind of eight triangle-ish uh, spokes right there. And in the front, these are 19 inch rims. You get the Brembo brakes in the front, of course, and the huge rotors. Has Nitto. G2 tires or NT555 G2 tires. These are 275 40 ZR19s in the front and they have a really good amount of tread left and you can see just how much tread is on those tires in the front here. So the back tires are going to be 20 inches or the rims and the tires are going to be 20 inches. Front fender is in fantastic condition. I didn't see any dents or dings on there. This one does come with the HID headlamps and the LED running lights and the factory fog lights. Front bumper and lower valence are in excellent shape. It also has a Shelby cooler there that has been swapped out for the factory one, which is pretty cool. Um, you always want to check on these GT500s for corrosion along the hood. And this one is absolutely perfect, so no corrosion there. And the rest of the hood is in really nice shape, as are the stripes. Coming around to the passenger side, no major dents or dings on that fender. The Cobra logo looks good. Sticker looks good on this side. And the passenger side rim, no major scuffs or scrapes on there. Do note that you get the Cobra um, valve stem covers on there as well. Sterling gray, one of my favorite grays from Ford. Has a lot of metal flake in it. Looks good in the sunlight. And as you go down this side of this 2013 Shelby GT500, take note of how clean that body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you are far away, or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the car, you can see the car, hear the car, and have confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises, and you can make a smart, an informed buying decision from wherever you're at. And if you get the sh car shipped to you, you can have that peace of mind as well. And if this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful, and that Brett sent you very clean down that side. This back rim is just as nice as the front ones. And on the back, we have two 9535ZR20 tires. And these tires have just as much tread as the front tires, surprisingly. Frame and underbody looks really good. Rear quarter, I didn't see any dents or dings on there. It does have the LED tail lamps. This one has the Ford Racing Performance Exhaust, and this thing sounds fantastic. We're gonna start it up in just a minute. Um, the rear trunk plastic piece here looks good. You get the GT500 logo on there, deck lid spoiler, and once again, all the stripes look really good. Has a nice louver on it, 
for the rear window. And this one comes with all the stuff. So um, the original, I don't know if that's a secondary cooler, um, but it, that's what the Shelby cooler is switched out with. The o OEM hardware um, has the original window sticker, whole bunch of stuff in the book here, including the certificate of authenticity uh, on this car and uh, just Carfax and all that good stuff. So that comes with the vehicle, original air cleaner. Here's the original window sticker. If you wanna peek at this, feel free to pause it. So you can see the optional equipment. This one has the SVT performance package, the uh, navigation system electronics package, and the Recaro Shelby Man leather seats. Um, so, Original sticker was 62425 on this car. And then there's even more Mustang book, a um, whole bunch of GT500 literature in there for you. And some more LED lights. And looks like everything that was original with this car, um, original air intake and everything, and a car cover. Now this is not the Shelby car cover, but it is a car cover. And then you get a tire inflator kit underneath there. Anyways, a lot of stuff in there. Comes with a GT500 gas cap cover, that's pretty cool. And as you go down this side of the car, just as clean as that passenger side, and the dents or dings on the rear quarter. And for full disclosure, this back rim is in fantastic condition as well. I didn't see any scuffs or scrapes on any of these rims. Driver's side door looks really good. And you do get the power mirrors with the built-in blind spot mirrors. Inside, as promised, this one has the Recaro leather and suede interior seats. You get the Cobra stitched into the backrest. You can always tell if you have Recaros because they got their names stitched on the seats as well. Take a look behind the seats here. Back seats are very clean. It does have latch child safety system. If you want to try and put a car seat back there, that's your challenge. Uh, driver's seat height adjuster, and it does come with Shelby GT500 floor mats. This one does have the launch control, the different steering um, feels, and then the uh, different suspension there as well. Uh, power locks, power mirrors, and power windows. We'll hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, everything that this car has to offer on the interior, and then we'll start it up and take a look under the hood, listen to that exhaust, and uh, yeah, all the good stuff that this car provides. 8,476 miles are on this vehicle. Instrument cluster is very nice and clean. Comes with the suede and leather wrapped steering wheel. Bluetooth and audio controls on the right. You get the Cobra logo in the center and information center and cruise controls on the left. This one has the touchscreen radio, has the factory navigation system on it. You get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities on here. There we go, there's Sirius. This one also has a hard drive with a jukebox and you can uh, upload music to it from a CD to this radio and then store songs in there. So that's pretty cool as well. It does have the CD player. It comes with a Shelby plaque right there. It also has the a really nice GT500 uh, ball on the stick shift there. Stability control, that's for your trunk popper. This one does have the ambient lighting. You can change the colors on those and the passenger side floor mat and seat are in fantastic condition. No rips or tears on there. Smells very clean inside this car. I don't think it's ever been smoked in and the headliner is in very nice condition as well. You do get home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems and map lights. All right, I'm gonna open the door so that we can hear this thing start. Pop the hood here. Turn my light off and then we'll go check out that Ford Performance exhaust and then take a look under the hood. Sounds really good. I 
love the sound of that Ford Performance exhaust on the 5.8. And I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality, condition, options, and cleanliness of this car all the way around. Inside and out there, those HID lights. Under the hood, we have the 5.8 liter supercharged V8 engine. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. They got GT500 caps on everything. Um, we've got a Cobra for the fuse box, we've got Cobras on the strut towers, and uh, just very, very clean. You can see this one was made by Chad Walla and Amy LeMay, maybe. Anyways, love those powder coated heads. And uh, once again, this car has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. Has some Shelby hood struts there. And uh, this car is 100% ready to go. There's your emission sticker. And I would highly recommend this car from a quality and condition standpoint. I don't think you'll find too many as clean as, and as nice as this one. And to see more pictures of this car, one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, sports cars, GT500s, Mustangs, Corvettes, Camaros, Challengers, Chargers, you name it, we got to go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos we do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left. A link to more GT500 videos that I've done in the upper right. A link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. And we're super excited to uh, help you with this ultra clean 2013 Ford Mustang GT500 in Sterling Gray Metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on my YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.